and everything uh, looks symmetrical. You got your. Uh, 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 good. Good. And now, your oxygen saturation is 92 percent, which is um, really low. These are white blood cells. Okay. These are red blood cells. See it? Oh, they okay. look wormy like that. Yeah. They're fed by sugar. Actose, 30 milligrams of sugar. Okay, you can stop that. Four minutes. I'm going to stop that too. So med 9? Yeah. Yeah, we're going to stop that. Today, you know, the philosophy of most people is better living through chemistry, which, you know, is a you know, modern opportunity, but it also has its price. You know, now you see the, the drug that's been using for type 2 diabetes for so long that now it's under fire. They're going to put the black box on it that says make heart, heart failure. So my view is start with a natural approach. Maybe you have to go to chemistry, but why not exhaust that possibility so you don't end up having all these side effects that you find out five years, 10 years later, 20 years later, when maybe it's too late. I would expect that uh, as we're unfolding, that probably by the end of the week, most people will be off insulin. What's 62. So okay, just be, just be patient with it. You're you're off your medication, and your body's still getting acclimated to what we're doing here. So just write it down on your sheet and I'm show going it to under Ellen. a rock now. No, but it'll it'll get better. It'll get better. Okay, so that's mm -hmm. a 60 point drop and you cut your insulin by a third. A third. Okay. Uh, I didn't take it last night. Great. Wow. So that's even better. <laughs> wow. So what was your blood sugar today? Four hundred. Whoa. Oh. Yeah, you know, it'll come down so you can see. take its time. Everybody goes at different rates. Everybody's different. Everybody's a little different. I mean, everybody's moving very fast. You know, when you're talking about something that the New York Times says is incurable, everyone here is off insulin. Or, you know, I mean, you've cut your insulin in half as a type one. Isn't that so bad? So <coughs> you have to hold the perspective. A lot of people use food to stuff their emotions. And as people begin to heal, they begin to let loose of some of those negative emotions and they need to be cleared as part of the healing process. So we see that happen. I don't know what's wrong with me, but um, I feel really strange. And I can walk all the time. My legs, I feel like I'm going all over. I don't know what the hell is wrong with me. I feel weak. I, I could walk this any other time. And I feel like my body is going another way. 
It's boring in the house. I'm bored to death. I just want this 30 days to be over. I'm sure the doctor is right. But for me, my physiology, I need something to eat. And I, I just feel so in so inferior to the people at the house because they're just doing it. I'm the only one that's like having a hard time. This isn't usually my personality. I'm not this down, but I feel crappy. I just totally made up my mind today that um, I'm gonna leave. It's not because of my health issues. It's not because of anyone. I just want to go home. I can't be away from my family that long. I'm really sorry if I, that I disappointed everyone, but um, I had to do this for myself. Is Michelle going home? For sure. I think she's really, really missing her family, and so far she hasn't really seen that much progress. It's hard to tell her that it's only a month. It's not that big a deal. Like, why go to all the hassle when just we're almost done with the first week already? I know it, it must be hard, but you can only imagine how much your family would miss you if you get sick because of diabetes and, yeah. you know, pass away. The thing is, it's so much healthier for her, you know what I mean? Like, for all of us, like, it's going to be so much better for her in the long run. Why can't she see that? It takes time, you know? Five days, is that's not enough time to give it, give it a chance to work. No. I have a feeling that I want to leave, too. Why would you want to leave, though? My spirit tells me. You know, we, we subconsciously can deceive ourselves too with fears and emotions that we don't understand. How do you differentiate between the spirit and... Um, your inner self. Your inner yeah, self I know, but, I, I know, you, but you that's intuition. Wrong. That's kind of like intuition. It has nothing to do with intuition. Well, I, I don't understand what uh, how you differentiate that's between it, your you inner self. You do not understand. You're yeah. Catholic. Well, I mean, I'm still here. Well, being. you have your beliefs and I have mine. Mm. That's the individual thing. Okay. I know this is going to work for you, you know? This is really important. I know this has probably been a blessing that you've been asking for. And you know sometimes things happen and it just seems like a scaling back, but going to move forward. Oh, no. As much as you believe in God, God as much as you sing in church, and, I and I know you pray for this, I know. and this is, this, is, this is why you're here, this is why we're all here. All of us want this change. You want this thing so bad, you're forgetting where you came here for, not just for you, but for your children, right? Actually, yeah, 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 because I did right. tell my son, I said, That's he right. didn't want me to go. He cried uncontrollably, unconsolably, and I looked at, and I'm holding him, and I'm looking at myself in the mirror, and I'm saying, but baby, I'm, you, you, you want a new mommy, don't you? So yeah, I did. I did, you know. Yeah. It'd just kill us to see you leave. I know. Now, Especially when we know you're so you're capable. I know, but I already <coughs> made my decision. Oh, you can't do that. I already and made up my mind. Do you know what a blessing this is? I know. How can you do that? Don't, don't you want to get through this and be the person you want to be? I, I thank the Lord every day for being here. I thank you, dear Lord, to give me the opportunity. I couldn't have done this by myself. I didn't even know that this was a way. I didn't even know. This wasn't an option from the doctors. Sure. I didn't know. How many people can you touch with this knowledge here and you actually lived to heal the diabetes? Can you see the opportunity you have? We're just rooting for you. We want to see you at the end of the 30 days. With that smile that you came in here with. <laughs> with that fire burning. Thank you. And I know you can do it.